Today is my second day of the April boot camp for the May Painting ch Challenge by Warboss Tay. A um, little bit of progress on this guy. He's. Well, I guess I'll start with the easy stuff, the base. Um, glue's drying. I'm going to paint that up. Then we have the Tyranid Shrike. He is. Yeah, magnetized. So that if I just want him to be a warrior, he can just be a warrior. Um, these arms are also magnetized, but the glue is drying. Um, probably going to do some green stuff just to clean that up a bit more. And probably get them primed, hopefully, tonight. So there's a little bit of progress on them. Uh, the wings, scale-wise. Oh, is he... Scale-wise look pretty good. Uh, this is just standard. Um, these little tiny hooks are going to be my sighting talons. Uh, this is the stock build with the devourer. Um, looks pretty good though. Arms are pretty good. They're not super tyranny, but on this side they'll do. So we have those. And now for the questions. Um, why this project? This is the day two question. Uh, the reason why I picked this project is because I have a couple other projects on the go. Um, I'm doing my 500 point challenge right now for myself just to get 500 points of Tyranids done. Uh, Space Marines turned out great. Demons turned out really well. Um, and Tyranids are slowly gaining progress. Um, I also, in either June or July, my friend is coming from out of province and he wants to have a mega game. Uh, basically a mega game is an apocalypse game without any giant crazy things. Um, it's basically just force organization chart restricted so if you have an HQ and two troop and you can take three heavy. If you want another heavy you have to have another HQ and two troop <clears throat> and so on and so forth. So you can't take like three Bane Blades and some knights. Um, well, you would be able to take the knights, but <clears throat> they're not. We're not playing knights because I'm playing Tyranids and he doesn't have any. But he better not. If he does, he lied to me. Um, we don't know exactly how many points. We're aiming for about. Um, we're not doing a battle report or anything. It's just going to be a fun game. Uh, we might have friends join in just to increase the points. But we're aiming for around the 5,000 point mark uh, per player. So he'll have 5,000, I'll have 5,000. And even though it's not painted, um, even built is fine. But I want to get as much painted for this as I can. So my 500 points is going to go in. Um, everything in my May challenge will be in the battle as well. And I don't have any shrikes. Um, I've got... Um, 40 gargoyles built and primed and another 20 on sprue and I don't really want to limit my hive tyrant to babysitting them so I figured a small group of shrikes would be good to go. They can fly around Oop, top heavy this arm turns a bit <laughs> it's a little top heavy but he'll be glued to his base when he's ready um, so yeah, the big game coming up, and I just want some things done. And I've been wanting to do Shrikes for a while. I've been wanting to test them out in a game. I just haven't really got around to it. So this is my motivation to get this done. Um, it'll add to the collection nicely and give, uh, probably give me more motivation to finish the squad at least. Um, what is your motivation? Uh, again, my motivation is both getting models painted, which with the 500 point series I've been doing have been a big help, and this will get all my HQs done. Um, every Tyranid model I have that can be an HQ choice, if I complete my May challenge, will be completed. So that's good. My motivation for this model, again, is to have my gargoyles be able to have Synapse so they can operate as little um, airstrikes, I guess. And then finally, what will happen to your models when done? Um, they're basically going on the shelf. Um, 
not the shelf as in I won't play them anymore, but on the shelf is I'm clearing space in my cabinet to put them in and going to start playing more Tyranids. Um, have some painted models and go from there. Um, so I'm just going to zoom out a little bit. My friend traded me, because he's not playing Tyranids anymore, an Exocrine. And this, this guy right here is the reason why my 500 point list probably isn't done by now because I saw him and I'm like nope I'm building him I love him awesome model um, I'm just working on his base right now so cool um, all I have left on him is some poison and to finish his base and he's basically done um, yeah so that's him some other progress just cause doing videos is I have five Hormigons almost done sorry about reaching across the camera there so five little guys I say little cause he's huge just awesome model um, but yeah so the Shrike is current priority um, but the Exocrine is almost done um, so I'll have another update tomorrow and that's it for this painting challenge boot camp video